Hi there, join me at uh, the allotment again. Quite a different day to uh, the previous days that I've been up here recently. It has been seasonably warm weather, it's been very sunny, very dry. But the last couple of days, uh, it's been a bit more you know, traditional April showers, and quite a lot of rain, which the, the allotment needed actually. So, uh, yeah, just been uh, seeing how things things have really shot up the last few days with, with that bit of extra rain. Uh, much needed rain and uh, yeah it's sort of been raining on and off while I've been here sort of uh, for most of the late morning early afternoon so it's just started again now so I'm going to sort of be quite quick but this needs a different type of whiskey to uh, the sort of lighter um, sort of ones that we've uh, been talking about sort of on the allotment dram so today I've picked a uh, smoke head this is much better, uh, it's an Isla single malt and it's in this sort of traditional Isla, sort of peaty, smoky style and it's uh, much more suited for you know, a bit more blustery, cold, chilly, rainy sort of day like today and um, it's bottled at 43% and uh, you'll see it's, uh, it's an OH statement and it also doesn't say what the distillery uh, involved uh, is uh, there's lots of speculation you know if you look around on uh, the internet uh, and uh, you, you can see various people speculating about what distillery it might be but to, to me it doesn't really matter um, it gives you all these traditional sort of Isla characteristics that you would expect you know sort of smoky uh, PT quite full on you can tell by the packaging it's quite sort of funky and quite uh, sort of out there and it was actually launched in 2006 and at the time you know whiskies didn't look like uh, didn't look like that so um, really shook up the category a little bit and uh, you know, gave gave people something a little bit different so let, let's have a try you can see a lovely you know, golden yellow color there and then it's like boom you know you've got that you, if you've ever been to Isla, it takes you straight there. It's it's literally peatiness, earthiness, smokiness. There's a bit of like damp earth and moss, a bit of seaweed, this type of thing. But also underneath, a little bit of um, honey, vanilla uh, uh, as well. So let's have a taste. Yeah, that packs a uh, packs the sort of punch you'd expect. Uh, it's full on, all, all the peat smoke is up front and then as that, that sort of fades it um, does give you a, a quite sort of a, this sort of peppery sort of heat sort of fades it does give you a, this sort of sweeter honey vanilla there's a bit of that stewed green apple or something in there uh, as well so um, absolutely lovely about 35-40 pounds uh, most places you'll find it um, so yeah, still, you know, an excellent example after all these years, and um, yeah, absolutely fabulous. Uh, so I'll leave you now because the rain's got a little bit heavier, and I've still got to walk home. So I think I'm going to pack my things up and and head home now. So cheers, everyone. Keep safe, and I'll speak to you again soon. Bye bye.